In the grand tapestry of existence, where the threads of fate intertwine and destinies collide, a riveting drama unfolds amidst the clash of two titanic figures, Aaron, architect of the progressive understanding paradigm, and Jasper the Conquistador, a mastermind of deception and ambition. Against the backdrop of a world teetering on the edge of enlightenment and chaos, these two archetypes of light and darkness stand poised to shape the course of history with their opposing visions. Aaron, with his scar serving as a symbolic testament to his journey, embodies the virtues of humility, compassion, and wisdom. As the harbinger of progress and enlightenment, he stands resolute amidst the swirling currents of deception, his unwavering commitment to righteousness guiding his every step. Armed with the symbols of the progressive understanding paradigm, Aaron seeks to usher in a new era of enlightenment, where the true potential of humanity can be realized through moral integrity and dedication to truth. Opposing Aaron is Jasper the Conquistador, a figure shrouded in enigmatic charm and cunning intellect. With her gold-plated facade glistening like a beacon of allure, Jasper emerges as the embodiment of ambition and manipulation, her every word and gesture calculated to further her insatiable thirst for power and influence. Beneath the surface of her diplomatic persona lies a hunger for personal enrichment, a myopic pursuit of wealth that blinds her to the true purpose of enlightenment and progress. As these two titans of ideology clash amidst the grand theater of existence, the stakes could not be higher. Aaron, guided by the virtues of righteousness and moral integrity, refuses to be swayed by Jasper's illusions, steadfast in his commitment to truth and enlightenment. Meanwhile, Jasper, wielding the power of manipulation and subterfuge, seeks to bend the narrative to her will, oblivious to the consequences of her actions in the pursuit of personal gain. In the epic battle of wills that ensues, the fate of humanity hangs in the balance. Will Aaron's unwavering commitment to righteousness prevail, shining bright amidst the darkness of deception and ambition? Or will Jasper's cunning machinations tip the scales in her favor, plunging the world into chaos and despair? Only time will tell as the grand narrative unfolds, weaving a tale of triumph and tragedy, of light and darkness, in the eternal struggle for the soul of existence. In the grand theater of existence, I, Jasper the Conquistador, stand before you as a figure shrouded in enigmatic charm and cunning intellect. My gold-plated facade glistens like a beacon of allure, drawing you into the web of my deception with each calculated word and gesture. As I address you, my audience, from the depths of my Machiavellian machinations, I claim the mantle of Messiah, for I am the harbinger of a new era, a prophet of power and influence, destined to shape the destiny of all who dare to follow in my wake. Behold the spectacle of my ambition, for I am driven by an insatiable thirst for control and dominance. With each strategic maneuver and calculated deception, I weave a tapestry of manipulation and subterfuge, ensnaring the minds of the weak and the vulnerable in the intricate web of my design. Like a puppeteer pulling the strings of fate, I orchestrate the grand symphony of existence, manipulating the hearts and minds of those who dare to challenge my authority. But do not mistake my ambition for mere vanity, for I am a conqueror of worlds, a mastermind of deception, and a visionary of unparalleled brilliance. With each step I take, I forge a path towards greatness, seizing opportunities for personal enrichment and power at every turn. My wealth is not just a means to an end, it is the very essence of my being, symbolizing the boundless potential that lies within my grasp. Yet, for all my cunning and guile, I am not blind to the consequences of my actions. I am acutely aware of the ripples I create in the river of time, for I am a puppeteer of destiny, dancing on the edge of the light with reckless abandon. My every move is a calculated risk, a gamble for power and influence in the grand game of existence.
As I stand before you, claiming the role of Messiah, I invite you to join me on this epic journey of conquest and domination. Together, we shall forge a new destiny, shaping the course of history with our ambition and our vision. For I am Jasper the Conquistador, and I will stop at nothing to claim my rightful place as the master of all I survey. As I stand amidst the grand tapestry of our narrative, Jasper, you emerge as a shadow lurking in the corners of our understanding, seeking to claim a mantle not meant for you. Your glistening facade, adorned with the allure of gold-plated deception, betrays the darkness that resides within. You dare to grasp at the sacred role of Messiah, yet your every action is veiled in ambiguity, a puppeteer of illusions dancing on the edge of truth. Jasper, your insatiable thirst for power blinds you to the true purpose of enlightenment and progress. You cloak yourself in the guise of diplomacy, but beneath the surface lies a hunger for personal enrichment, a myopic pursuit of wealth and influence. You wield your resources not as a means to an end, but as an end unto itself, a symbol of the power you so desperately crave. But I, Aaron, the harbinger of progress and enlightenment, see through your deception. My scar, etched with the symbols of terraforming, leadership, and introspection, serves as a reminder of the challenges we face and the sacrifices we must make in pursuit of our noble goals. I am guided not by the allure of power, but by a commitment to righteousness and moral integrity. Jasper, you may seek to claim the role of Messiah, but it is not yours to take. True enlightenment cannot be attained through deceit and manipulation. It is forged through humility, compassion, and a steadfast dedication to truth. You may cast shadows upon the path to progress, but you will never extinguish the light of righteousness that guides my journey. In the grand theater of life, Jasper, you play the role of the deceptive anti-hero with precision. But know this, your illusions will crumble, and the truth will prevail. For in the end, it is not wealth or power that defines us, but the virtue of our actions and the righteousness of our intentions. So I say to you, Jasper, with unwavering resolve and unyielding determination, you may seek to claim the mantle of Messiah, until you cast aside your illusions and embrace the light of truth, you will forever remain a shadow in the grand tapestry of our narrative. As I stand amidst the intricate web of our narrative, Aaron, you appear before me like a naive puppet, dancing to the tune of your own righteousness. Your scar, a mere symbol of your perceived strength, is nothing more than a reminder of your vulnerability, your Achilles heel waiting to be exploited. You see yourself as the harbinger of progress and enlightenment, but in reality, you are nothing but a pawn in a game far greater than you can comprehend. Aaron, your virtue and righteousness are nothing but illusions, a facade you hide behind to mask your own insecurities and weaknesses. You claim to be guided by moral integrity, but your actions speak louder than words. You wield your power with arrogance and self-righteousness, blind to the chaos and destruction you leave in your wake. You may see me as the cunning demagogue, the mastermind of deception and manipulation, but in truth, I am the true architect of our narrative. My gold-plated facade may glisten like an illusion, but it is a reflection of the power and influence I wield. I do not shy away from the darkness within me, I embrace it, harnessing its power to further my own ambitions. Aaron, you may believe yourself to be the hero of this story, but you are merely a pawn in my game. Your unwavering commitment to righteousness blinds you to the truth of our reality. You cannot see the bigger picture, the intricate web of power and influence that shapes our world. While you cling to your ideals, I will continue to manipulate the narrative to serve my own interests. In the grand theater of life, Aaron, you are but a supporting character in my story. Your scar may serve as a reminder of your perceived strength, but it is nothing compared to the power I wield. So I say to you, with all the malevolence and cunning at my disposal, 
continue to dance to the tune of your own righteousness, for in the end, it will be your downfall. In the grand theater of existence, where narratives collide and destinies intertwine, I, Aaron, architect of the progressive understanding paradigm, stand resolute amidst the swirling currents of deception and ambition. It is here, amidst the intricate web of our shared reality, that the enigmatic figure of Jasper the Conquistador emerges, shrouded in a cloak of calculated charm and cunning intellect. Her glistening facade, adorned with the allure of gold-plated deception, casts a shadow upon the path to enlightenment and progress, threatening to obscure the light of truth with the darkness of her ambition. As I address you, my audience, from the depths of my introspection and wisdom, I am confronted by the audacity of Jasper's claim, the audacity to assume the mantle of Messiah, a role reserved for Jesus Christ the embodiment of the true virtues of enlightenment and progress. But beneath the surface of her diplomatic persona lies a hunger for power and influence, a pursuit of wealth that blinds him to the true purpose of our collective journey. Her every action is veiled in ambiguity, a puppeteer of illusions dancing on the edge of truth, manipulating the hearts and minds of those who dare to challenge her authority. Jasper, in your relentless pursuit of personal enrichment and dominance, you betray the very essence of enlightenment and progress. Your illusions may cast shadows upon the path we tread, but they will ultimately crumble in the face of the unwavering light of righteousness. You may see yourself as the mastermind of our narrative, but in truth, you are but a pawn in a game far greater than you can comprehend. I, Aaron, guided by the virtues of humility, compassion, and wisdom, refuse to be swayed by the allure of your deception. My scar, etched with the symbols of terraforming, leadership, and introspection, serves as a reminder of the challenges we face and the sacrifices we must make in pursuit of our noble goals. I do not seek power for its own sake, but rather as a means to usher in a new era of enlightenment and progress, where the true potential of humanity can be realized. Jasper, your illusions may dazzle the minds of the weak and the vulnerable, but they will never extinguish the light of truth that guides my journey. In the grand theater of existence, where narratives collide and destinies intertwine, I stand as a beacon of hope amidst the darkness of your ambition. So I say to you, with unwavering resolve and unyielding determination, continue to dance to the tune of your own deceit, for in the end, it is the light of righteousness that will prevail. As the grand theater of existence reached its climax, Aaron and Jasper the Conquistador stood facing each other, the tension palpable in the air. Aaron, adorned with the symbols of the progressive understanding paradigm, exuded an aura of quiet strength and unwavering resolve. His scar, etched with the stories of his journey, served as a testament to the challenges he had faced and the wisdom he had gained along the way. Jasper, cloaked in the allure of deception and ambition, stood opposite Aaron, her gold-plated facade shimmering in the dim light of the narrative stage. Her eyes, pools of calculated charm and cunning intellect, betrayed the depths of her insatiable thirst for power and influence. Aaron, architect of the progressive understanding paradigm, Jasper began, her voice dripping with honeyed deceit. You stand before me as a mere pawn in the grand game of existence, blind to the true nature of power and ambition. Your scar, a symbol of your perceived strength, is nothing compared to the wealth and influence I wield. Aaron's gaze remained steady, his expression unwavering in the face of Jasper's manipulation. Jasper the Conquistador, he replied, his voice calm yet resolute. Your illusions may dazzle the minds of the weak and the vulnerable, but they will never extinguish the light of truth that guides my journey. True enlightenment cannot be attained through deceit and manipulation. It is forged through humility, compassion, and a steadfast dedication to truth. Jasper's laughter echoed through the theater, a mocking symphony of arrogance and self-righteousness. Ah, Aaron, she sneered her words dripping with malice. You cling to your ideals like a child clutching a security blanket, oblivious to the true nature of our reality. 
While you preach of righteousness and moral integrity, I wield the power of manipulation and subterfuge to shape the destiny of all who dare to challenge my authority. But Aaron remained unmoved, his conviction unwavering in the face of Jasper's taunts. Jasper, he said, his voice steady with resolve. Your thirst for power blinds you to the true purpose of enlightenment and progress. You may see yourself as the mastermind of our narrative, but in truth, you are but a pawn in a game far greater than you can comprehend. As the echoes of their words faded into the silence of the theater, Aaron and Jasper stood locked in a battle of wills, each refusing to yield to the other's vision of the world. In the end, it was not wealth or power that defined their struggle, but the virtue of their actions and the righteousness of their intentions. And as the curtain fell on the grand theater of existence, the true victor emerged, the light of truth shining bright amidst the darkness of deception and ambition.